Hello ladies and gentlemen and we are back with Smackdown Live! Tonight we are going to have two defences of championships. Kane with the United States Championship and the Hardy Boys with the Tag Team Championships. It's all going to happen tonight. What's been going on with Kane? What will come of Eric Bischoff's challenge of the brand off? Triple H wants to address that first of all before the action kicks off. And here we go, our CEO of the WWE Universe coming out here to speak further on the challenge by Eric Bischoff, Raw's general manager. We don't know whether this is a personal battle between the two, but what we do know is it's going to give us an amazing pay-per-view. Last week, Eric, you caught me off guard. But this week, I up the game. It will be a brand off, but it will be four versus four ladder tag match for the money in the bank briefcase. Wow. Wow, what an announcement by the CEO here. Short but sweet and straight to the point. Let's get into the action tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the United States Championship. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen, the rematch from Extreme Rules. Nakamura was kind of shocked at the upset and the cash-in from Kane and uh, just wanted his rematch as soon as possible. So here we are. Will Nakamura for any better tonight? Kane, he's been on a bit of a wall path recently. We don't really know what's going on with him. Um, but uh, even with that knowledge, Nakamura still wanted that uh, this fight this evening. So we'll have to see what happens here. He looks ready. He looks focused. Here he is. The Red Big Machine Kane. We'd love to be able to tell you about... Uh, how Kane feels about the United States Championship, but um, again, Kane in interviews, they don't tend to go well. But here he is, nevertheless, ready to defend his championship. Kane always looks ready and for a fight, but he's looking particularly more fired up than usual. He 
Introducing the challenger from Kyoto, Japan, weighing in at 220 pounds, Shinsuke Nakamura! Nakamura looks very focused. Introducing the champion <clears throat> from parts unknown, weighing in at 326 pounds, he is the United States champion, Kane! There he is, the Red Pig Machine! You gotta give it guts to that uh, referee walking up to Kane there, asking for the belt so that he can uh, show it to the world and what is up for grabs. And here we go! Oh, Nakamura going straight on the offensive here to Kane. Kane not seeming phased. Seems, you know, he, we, again, we don't know what his issue has been uh, these last few weeks, but he, he's here, he's ready to compete. Nakamura trying to keep Kane down here. I've said it near enough every week now that it's a good tactic, but you have to make sure it works. Oh my god, a, a bear hug, but Nakamura with the counter there. Kane in the corner. And that, oh my god. Big red machine going for a big ride there. Wow, Nakamura is picking Kane apart here. Is this it? Was it a fluke for Kane? Does Nakamura have Kane's number? And the ref? No. Kane. Only a one count. My God, Nakamura is picking apart Kane, but Kane. Getting back into the fight here. And wow, just chucking him around the ring there. And then ch just choking off Nakamura's air supply. My God. It, is he trying to make Nakamura tap? I mean, what? My God, Kane, you're going to kill him. And oh, that savagery beating on the skull of Nakamura. And then again, going back to the choking. My God, we've seen Kane sadistic before, but the, I, I, you've got to say that that side of Kane has come back. And what? No, Nakamura countering. Very wise by Nakamura. You don't want to be on the shoulders of the big red machine. Oh, God, a big solid right fist from Nakamura. Going for the pin to... No. Kane may be running out of some gas here. We're not used to seeing this. We're used to Kane just got. Oh, and here we go. Oh, God. That's got to be it. That's got to be it. And Nakamura's done it. Nakamura's done it. He's got his championship back. My God. Well. Will Kane care about this? Is the question. Is Kane more wanting the carnage rather than the gold? We just don't know. But either way, Nakamura has 
got back his United States Championship. Here is your winner and the new United States Champion, Shinsuke Nakamura. Let me tell you something, Nakamura earned that. Every time you step into the ring, it's dangerous. But when you step into the ring with Kane, well, you know you're going to hell. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen, our second defense of a championship the tag team championship Here we see Eric Young approaching the ring with the tag team known simply as Sanity. We don't really know why they got a chance at the tag team championships, but they have, nevertheless. What will they be able to do here tonight? Could we have an upset? After the match earlier of Kane versus Nakamura, Nakamura obviously getting his United States Championship back. And his tag team partner for the evening. A lot of boos in the crowd here tonight. Alexander has chosen to take the mantle for the uh, Sanity Tag Team Group with Eric Young. Alexander looking very fired up tonight. <clears throat> Maybe realizing that this could be uh, a real opportunity for the Sanity Group. And here we go, the Tag Team Champions. 
The Hardy Boys. And they look fired up tonight. Now Matt, he's had his issues with Kane, but we have been told that Kane had... Well, both Hardy Boys have had issues with Kane, but we have been told that Kane has been given a warning. He's not allowed to interfere in this match. So, uh, hopefully, you know, hopefully he'll obey by that, but we'll see. They look ready tonight. And their opponents, at a combined weight of 461 pounds, they are the SmackDown Tag Team Champions, Jeff Hardy and Matt Hardy, the Hardy Boys. And there they are. Now, the interesting thing about this is the Hardy Boys were up for this tonight. They they don't want to be champions that just sit on their championships. No, they, they want to battle. They want to be worthy champions. And Jeff Hardy kicking it off. Oh, Jeff going straight in. Eric Young rolling out of the ring and then getting that cheap shot on Jeff Hardy. It's worked, no? It's worked for the Sanity Group. Jeff Hardy back on the attack. Eric Young going for the pin here. And just... Picking Jeff up and dumping him back down. <clears throat> we know the Hardy Boys. <clears throat> the veterans, they can do this. And Jeff tagging his brother in now, Matt Hardy. Saying, Matt, you, you want a piece of the sanity? Go get him. And Matt, running leg drop. And going for it again here. Right on the, the throat of Alexander. Gotta say, the, the Hardy Boys, they look back on form. They look ready. They've got fire. Matt Hardy staying on this relentless attack, the running bulldog. Eric Young saying, tag me in. Can Eric Young pull this back for Sanity now? The leader of Sanity. But Matt, he, he's staying on this attack here. And the tag. Jeff coming in. Oh my God! Well, the Hardy Boys just on top form tonight. 
Like I said, they wanted this match. They are on fire. Jeff says no. Twist of fate. Well, Jeff, sensing, saying this is over. He, oh, oh my God. That's it. That's it. No. Alexander coming in to save, but he's not the ref out. Well, it's just carnage in the ring now. Ref trying to get back to his feet. Are, are refs here? They're not, they, you know, they're not wrestlers. There's some action going on outside the ring there, but it seems to have calmed down now. And the ref again! Ref, you need to be faster. Oh, God, insanity. You just feel is taking control of the situation here. Jeff beating on the skull of Alexander Wolf. Now, what can the Hardy Boys develop here? Oh my God! Matt now saying this is over. Well, what can they do here? And just beating on the skull again. Matt going for the pin. That's the two cap. No. And Matt, a, a little bit of frustration maybe kicking in there. He says this should be over. Alexander trying to get... Oh, my God! Trying to bring the Sanity Group back into this match. Matt Hardy, though. Well... And twist up faint! Going for the pin now. One, two... And that's it. It's over. The Hardy Boys have defended the championship. It, it, looked, uh, it looked a little bit touch and go there for a moment, but... Uh, the Hardy Boys, they know how to play this game. They are veterans here on the SmackDown brand. And the, the referee getting some action. We don't really see that a lot. But, uh, yeah, maybe maybe the Sanity will have a talking to backstage. But either way, an incredible match tonight. And there they go. Building up on the momentum. They're feeling it. And the crowd showing their appreciation. And well, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it. Well, thank you so much for coming out tonight. And what? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What? My God. Oh, my God. I can't. I can't believe it. It's. It's Shawn Michaels. It's HBK. What's he doing out here? We, we were going to wrap up the show, but... My God! 
Well, let's see what Shawn Michaels has to say. Well, this will be a real treat for us this evening. Let me get straight to it, Hunter. You need a commander leading your SmackDown troops. Money in the bank pay-per-view brand off. What say you? Well, what? a way of wrapping up the show thank you so much everyone good night well ladies and gentlemen what an amazing show we had tonight uh it was pretty incredible to see all the stuff came defending and losing i mean I really thought Kane was going to win that. And the Hardy Boys coming out and doing what they do best. Shawn Michaels coming out. Um, but yeah, guys, um, I just want to say I think there's been a little bit of confusion with a few people. I don't play any of the matches. So if I'm sounding surprised or like, wow, that's massive... It's genuine. I play none of the matches. Computer does it all. Which means I don't genuinely know what's going to happen. So I just wanted to clear that up. Um, I'm sorry if the Shawn Michaels segment was a little bit cutty and pasty. Um, it was just the way I had to do it. I'm trying to get more creative. I'm trying to learn a bit more as I go. Maybe I'm getting too bold with this series. Do let me know. But uh, anyway, guys, I'm going to get the hell out of here, and I'll catch you guys in a bit. Bye-bye for now.